I need you to prove to me that they're in that car. They're not in that car. A week-long cruise to the Bahamas shipped these 60-year-old grandparents right into the hands of border protection. Where, where are they? they? That in then that where car. are they? Joe McDevitt recorded this exchange with officials on Monday afternoon. They detained all of us. We were in there for over an hour. When they get over there and they process properly, Right, right. Everything's okay. good. That's not my decision. McDevitt's wife is a Chinese American U.S. citizen. Her parents came to the U.S. five months ago on a travel visa that's still valid. My parents have done nothing but support me financially. They sent me here for college. They pay my entire four years of college. Well, I'm the only child of them. <laughs> They have done nothing but spending money in the U.S. either through me or come here as a tourist. McDevitt is an active member of the Army National Guard. He said this trip was supposed to be his father-in-law's final goodbye. He chose to take a trip because her dad is terminally ill with cancer. So, they, I mean, they've already removed his stomach and he, he has trouble eating. It's not good. A spokesperson for Customs and Border Protection told us they can't give us specifics due to privacy law. <laughs> and they're doing things the right way. So obviously the system now is really transmogrifying to really incentivizing illegal entry over doing things legally. I don't know, it's, it's just hard to believe that, like I said, everything that my family's done for this country and the, the way that the country's treating us right now. I can't believe, I cannot believe you guys just wanna kick them out.